travel is, is a transformative kind of business on the sense that pretty much everything that happens impacts us, whether it be innovation or, or industry affairs, um, and we're constantly evolving. But yet the consumer seems to embrace digital transformation. They love new apps, they new, love new gadgets, they love new booking tools. So it's almost, you know, as soon as the, the industry, uh, as in us and the technologies that have come out with something, uh, immediately it's adopted. Um, look, that's not always the case. I mean, certainly in the consumer space, but when you talk about corporate travel, actually there are probably many other challenges to just the, the app itself. There are security implications, policy type processes, governance, um, risk management and everything else. And for us, digital transformation has to cover all of those. It's not just about building a, a fancy front end. So talk to me where you are as a company in terms of what challenges you face right now or what you see coming down the line and the exciting developments. Sure. I, I wouldn't call them challenges or opportunities. There are a couple of key ones for us. One is, is the consumerization of corporate travel. We have travelers who in their day jobs are booking a, a business trip, going home in the evening and booking a, a holiday and they expect the same experience. So we're trying to bring a more aesthetically pleasing experience to the corporate space. On the flip side, behind the scenes, we have a content challenge, as in the inventory that we need to provide, that airline they want to travel on, the hotel room they want to stay in. The, the ways we access that content is changing constantly, some of it driven by innovation itself, other by economic factors. Um, so we are probably addressing both of those at exactly the same time, which is challenging. Talk to me about these style of events in terms of an open forum, an open discussion. Uh, today, obviously, you're here with Data Art, and everybody's prepared to, I suppose, listen and learn from each other rather than sell, you know, their product. Yeah, I've attended uh, a couple of previous events, um, and and they've been pretty engaging. I think we have an open conversation. I think the the moderators that they've had uh, have been great, um, and we've had some tough discussions, but discussed openly. So, so obviously. You enjoy the, I suppose, the conviviality, the people who are here. You enjoy being on the panel, Kevin and Charlotte. You know her very well. Uh, that that's important as well, not just kind of the the open discussion. Yeah, look, I, th I think the moderator makes a huge difference because if they're not asking the right questions or, or getting that right level of participation, it can be a very dry, one-sided type event, there's no doubt about that. At the same time, I think the audience itself helps on the basis that there are people in the room who are actually genuinely interested in the, the subject matter, um, and I think Data Art do a good job of sort of bringing those two together. Perfect. Thanks for your time, Paul. Okay. Thank you.